do you have a ClickFunnels account and you're wondering how to archive your funnels or how do you delete them? Why do we archive them? Um, basically in ClickFunnels, you cannot delete the funnel. You can go in and delete different pages, but to delete the funnel, you have to archive it. Now, at first I thought, oh, this is crazy. I'd rather just delete it and start from scratch. The nice thing about archiving is if you have a funnel that somebody gave you, um, maybe you downloaded it, um, you, you know, you went to somebody else's YouTube video or to, to, to their blog or something like that and they offered you a free funnel and it's not something you're using right now but it's building up your amount of funnels if you have the 97 dollars program you can only have 20 funnels 100 pages and that can get used up pretty quickly if people keep giving you all these free funnels so my advice is to go in clean up your funnels and only keep the ones that you are currently working on and archive them and the neat thing about archiving them is you can one control how many pages and funnels you have and you can always go back down and reinstate them so if you change your mind as you're building your business maybe you build a couple funnels that currently don't end up being profitable so you archive them you can go back into your archives and pull something else up so it is a good thing and I'm going to show you how to do it the first thing you want to do is go under click funnels up here the tab and then click funnels I'm going to go back and um, bring you through that step I'm going to land on the same page I was on, but I want to make sure that you can get in there. And I'm going to go under shared funnels. Um, I had categorized them and I've got a ton of them in here. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and choose. I had one picked out. Oh, the mentor uh, business in a box. There's a copy. All right, let's go to that one. It has seven pages and I can archive this. So I'm going to open it up. It's got seven pages. And if I'm not using it, usually when you get a copy and then you go to build your own, you end up with two copies. Um, so you, you really want to watch that. All right. So the one you're using in the copy of the copy, if that makes sense, um, may not. All right. I'm going to scroll over and I, all I do is go to the funnel. I haven't opened anything up and then I'm going to hit settings at the top. And then I'm going to scroll to the bottom in my settings. And right here it says archive funnel. You just select that and you have it archived. Um, I highly recommend you clean it up, archive it. You do not need to go out, fill up your funnel in here and go over the amount that you're allowed. If you're new, you can survive on the the pro the, the lower pro program at $97 a month you don't have to increase your membership just stay keep it small you're new um, you're just beginning you don't need those extra expenses you need to just learn how to organize all right um, thank you for coming today I am here to help you earn money save time and find balance in your life. So this was a time saver, hopefully, and actually save you money too. Um, if you if you go in and clean it up and stay within the perimeters of that, that $97 program. All right, that's all I got for you today. No links, just give me a thumbs up if this was helpful, and I'll see you on the next video.